Hey guys, welcome back to my garage. In this quick video, I wanted to show you the new C86 ACCP with the uh, built-on terminal blocks in case you have to cut your cables from Technic. Um, you can land them on terminal blocks now. So uh, let me uh, go around here and show you. So here's the new C86 ACCP. Uh, everything has remained the same, connectors, jumpers, uh, so forth. So there's nothing different there. But now we come down here, and you can see the terminal blocks are above the Molex connectors. From the left, uh, the orange, yellow, red, and brown wires are stripped and twisted and put into the ground connector. And then green is the HLFB positive, black is input B positive. Input B, by the way, is the step signal. White is input A, that's the direction signal. And blue is the enable signal. So blue is enable positive, white is uh, input A positive or the DER signal, black is input B positive or the step signal, and green is the HLFB positive signal, and again the red, the brown, the yellow, and the orange are all the grounds that go to the very left terminal. Uh, you have to be very careful when you strip the, uh, the negative, uh, red, brown, yellow, and orange, um, make sure they're twisted well together and then stick them in to the uh, terminal. Uh, you can't really solder them uh, because it'll make it too bulky and they won't go in underneath that set screw. Um, the rest I use ferrules. If you don't use the ferrules, which are the blue ends on the end of the wires, then you should uh, tin the wires with a little bit of solder and then go ahead and put them in the terminal blocks. Um, also, use care when you're stripping the jacket here. I use a, a very small, uh, like a, I use a very small X-Acto uh, knife uh, type razor blade and I just lightly score the outer jacket and then the end I'll cut through the jacket and then I'll peel the ends and then pull it back. The jacket will tear on your score. You do not have to go all the way through and you do not want to nick these wires here, okay? And then you can lightly score around the cable to uh, remove the rest of the jacket. And what I mean score is don't go all the way through, just, just barely with the razor, go around that jacket, score it, and then peel it off and it'll tear away. There's no need to try and force the blade into the, uh, the uh, wires. You don't want to da risk damaging the conductors. If you do and you're showing conductors, start over. Okay, so there's the C86 ACCP. I just want to give you an update on it. Uh, and that's where we're at uh, now. Um, I've, I went ahead. Um, I did test the Molex connectors before I cut my cable shorter. Now my cabinet's much nicer. Uh, cab cables are just need to be strain relieved right here with some tie wraps. And then I'm going to put some uh, uh, cable tie mounts here, and then I'm going to tie back these cables so there's not as much uh, stress on the C86 ACCP. Um, I went ahead and uh, crimped on new uh, Sabre pins, and I uh, got new uh, housings so I could shorten up my power cables to the Power 4 hub there. Okay, so that's it for this video. Talk to you guys soon.